Should we do a Target haul? <laughs> I look like I'm either trying to, okay, this is just not good, um, bury a body, like I just beat someone up, or I'm going through a mental breakdown. <laughs> I'm, none of those are true. But I had to buy two, there's people walking by, I hate this. Two hair dyes, because I don't know which one is gonna work. Because my hair is dyed black, and I like it, but there's a patch that's still kind of green, and I want to get rid of it. And then I bought like a bunch of like gauze and stuff, and band-aids, and then gloves. Um, that's all for tattooing. But like, if you don't know that, you're the average person, you don't just do tattoos yourself, you look like a psychopath. Just going in, buying all this first aid stuff, <laughs> and gloves. And it looks like I'm doing a fucking surgery. And then a hair dye. Yeah, it's just, it's not looking good. But I'm um, probably doing a tattoo today. That's why I got all this stuff. And I'm redoing my hair. Okay, goodbye. I'm spending New Year's Eve. JK, this is how we're spending New Year's Eve. With the puppies freaking out because of fireworks and we're watching Harry Potter. Happy New Year! I was just watching some TikToks and one of them was um, this girl and she like did a filter on her hair and it made her hair black and I'm like, ha, I already have black hair. Cause it's dyed. We got new soap dispensers. This is the one Brandon wanted. He wanted a clear one and that's like the only one I would agree on. <laughs> and this is mine, even though my bathroom is blue themed, unfortunately. They had a blue one but the amber one was just too cute and it was only one left, so. We had a blizzard warning a while ago and like a month ago, maybe not even a month ago. Anyway, and we barely got any snow, but now look how fast the snow is coming down. It's been doing this for about a minute and it's already collecting on the ground. This is the blizzard I was asking for. So for Christmas, I asked for silverware. <laughs> this is the most adult thing oh. ever. George, you never let me record anything. Oh. Um, I wanted them more like matte, oh. but they didn't have any. Actually, I think they did. Oh. Can you stop? It's just silverware, see? They had matte, but oh. it was like, it had matte, but it was like twice the amount. So my sister got these ones for me, but they look really nice. I just washed all of our old silverware. And I need to wash these to replace them because there's 20 pieces um, to replace them. And then probably gonna get rid of the old silverware and donate it or something. Even though I like the old silverware, it's time to say goodbye because we got some new stuff. Okay, I don't even have to ask if this is weird. I already know it's weird. But I wonder if anyone else exists in the world. Probably literally no one. Literally no one. I put, <laughs> I put chocolate chips on my pizza. Is that, that's weird, right? That's really weird. The reason I do it though, the reason I do it though is because I love chocolate croissants. And so like the bread of the pizza, like with the chocolate, it's like a chocolate croissant. But then when you think about the sauce and the cheese and chocolate, it kind of sounds like gross. And they're semi-sweet chocolate chips. No? That's ah, awkward. Of course my air turns on right now. Anyway, I got dog DNA tests for both the dogs because it was on sale for like half the price. It was still a lot of money to get them, but, um, it was half price, so like it was worth it. But we're gonna do these now. And yeah, don't, okay, you guys can't lick each other. I don't want your saliva getting mixed. Brandon thought that these were the results, yet we had, even though we hadn't even gotten <laughs> the testing kits yet. Are they even called testing kits? Collection kit, testing kits for COVID. Oh, 
Well, Georgia's very unhappy. There we go. First one. I need a pen. Yeah, I, I might have one in my backpack. Okay, well, I have to go online to activate this, so. All right, so I apparently you have to swab their mouth for 15 seconds with two swabs and then let them air dry, dry. Sorry, I've got a sore on my tongue. I can't talk that well. Um, air dry, air dry <laughs> for five minutes. and then package it, but don't seal it. Seems very odd. That for like your DNA test, you, they want it dried. Like, and it says to like, firmly roll and rotate this on their gums. So am I basically just peeling their skin off and then you're gonna test their skin? It has nothing to do with the saliva. It just seems odd that like you don't reseal it. Like when you do like a human DNA test, you spit in a tube. Okay, come on, Jupy. Jupy, come. Come. Okay, Jupy, come here. We do this for 15 seconds. Come here. Sit. Uh uh. Sit. Sit. You're really not gonna like this. All right, George's turn. Jupy's dried, and they're in their package. Now we're doing George's. Sit. Sit. Uh uh. Sit. Come here. Sit. Sit. You're starting to get aggressive. <laughs> okay, um, don't recommend this for your dogs that don't like being handled. Okay, we're gonna wait five minutes. Got them packaged. And I'm gonna ship them off tomorrow morning because it's like 9.30 right now. So, yeah, we're gonna drop it off in the mail tomorrow. Yeah, we'll go figure out what you are and what George is. George, we, Jupy, we were told she's a lab Doberman mix, but we don't know how true that is um, or what else she could have in her. We think she might have pointer. Everyone thinks she's pointer. Um, and George, we think he's an English foxhound mix of some sort, but also once upon a time we were told he was greyhound lab, so. I don't see either of those in him, honestly. I wouldn't be surprised if he has like a little bit of pit in him because of his bulky face. Okay, that's it. Um, you'll see in whatever vlog when the results arrive.